Whatever information the user has about a target network has a foothold to gather more information about the target. It uses a technique called transforms to gather new information using information that is already available. Start by selecting new up in the top left corner. And different types of information gathering are separated into different palettes to include devices, infrastructure, locations, pen testing, personal, and social network. Devices, infrastructure, and locations can be helpful for gathering information about a target company or organization. Personal and social network can be used for gathering information on specific individuals within an organization for social engineering purposes. And penetration testing integrates several pen testing tools into the Multigo platform. We're going to start with infrastructure. So we'll go ahead and expand that and then drag DNS name over to the center screen. By default, it loads the manufacturer server, alpine.panterva.com. We can change this name and perform information gathering on any target by entering a property view. But for now, we'll just go ahead and go with the manufacturer's server to perform the demonstration. So we'll start by resolving that server back to the parent domain. So right click it and then run transform, then convert to domain, and then to domain. And it immediately resolves the Alpine server back to Paterva.com. And then we can use that to start gathering information about that domain. So we'll start with gathering MX servers or mail servers, and then DNS from domain, and we'll gather name servers. Then we'll gather different hosts by using common domain names. And as you can see, within a few seconds, we've already gathered a whole bunch of information about this domain and enumerated numerous different systems to include mail servers, name servers, and different host systems. There's still a lot of information that can be gathered from the parent domain. But in addition to running transforms on it, we can also run transforms on all of the objects that were created as a result of previous inquiries. This allows us to use a point and click approach to continue to yield more and more useful information. Here we've just gathered the IP address of a particular host that was previously collected. We can also organize this information with different views that allow us to see different relations of different systems to each other. We can also select from main view, bubble view, or entity list, which will give us information about each of the different objects that have been discovered. So that's just one example of how you can use Multigo to gather information.